This is Zero Lemansky. Gabriel Wilson. This is not the first time we're recording this. <laughs> <laughs> so, Igor, what are you running? I am running for the Utah State Legislature. Awesome. So, I'm working for Igor's campaign. I'm one of his trainers around canvassing specifically. I've been canvassing myself. And it's quite the experience to watch Gabe canvass and interact with Salt Lake City folk who really haven't met anyone like Gabe. Mm -mm. <laughs> so uh, we're out here right now with you to raise some money for Igor's campaign. And we really uh, have the values of a grassroots initiative. So reaching out to many people, small donations will go a long way to support Igor. And just right now, I'd love to give Igor the floor just to share a little bit about him, and I'll close out. Thanks, Gabe. Mm -hmm. Uh, so one of the main reasons I'm running is uh, education. That's really dear to my heart. That's my full-time job at United Way of Salt Lake. Uh, immigration issues, uh, refugee issues. My mom immigrated this country from Egypt when she was 16. Clean air issues. We live in a bowl of toxic soup sometimes in Salt Lake City, and it's causing a lot of health problems for a lot of folks. I got involved in organizing in 2008. Uh, I got inspired by Barack Obama. He was a tall guy with a funny name, kind of like me. And I saw what happened when you actually organize people and help them to join their voice as one and make a change for something they believed in. And the fact that we can do that, uh, especially in times like this where we really need it, mean, mean a lot to me. And I'm running so we can have that opportunity to feel represented and pass policies that take care of every single one of us. Thank you. Thanks, man. So... All that Igor just said, I'm a yes to. And, and more importantly, I want to underscore uh, this man's heart is incredibly touching to me. His humanity, I think, is uh, incredibly rare and really valuable in our times, particularly when this, the, the, the stretch between self and other is so strong. We're just otherizing each other to, to an extent that we can't really talk. And I know, and I've seen Igor do this, he has a very dear commitment to hear one another. And when he does that, his humanity shines and it brings people together. Even if they don't share the same position, they do find common ground oftentimes. So as a conflict mediator myself, that quality in him is, you know, par none. So, so with that, I hope that you're moved to share whatever you can, um, donate to this man, his heart's in the right place. He's competent. He's beautiful. Let's make it happen. All right, y'all. Thanks, everybody. Take care. Bye.